Hello everybody, we are back here on the Hunter Call of the Wild and today I have some fantastic news for anybody that is playing on console. It is, uh, well, to say the least, I just woke up and I go on to Twitter and find out that they've finally announced the console release date and I know a lot of you have been eagerly awaiting that. It's been probably the biggest topic within the community on when the map's gonna release on console and well, we finally got a actual release date, and that release date is February 9th, so hopefully it stays that. Obviously, things could change if uh, they run into any issues or anything like that, but as of now, February 9th is the console release date. Now, along with the release of the map, you guys are also going to be getting all of the amazing fixes that came with the patch here on PC. You guys will finally have a lot of the animals fixed that used to be bugged. That includes the moose, the roe deer, the mule deer, the white-tailed deer. There's a bunch of stuff that's going to be fixed so that they're scoring correctly, which is going to be absolutely huge in making it so you guys can actually get the mule deer diamonds, the moose diamonds, and the roe deer diamonds. Because they had quite a few issues, as you guys probably know if you've been trying to get a diamond of any of those. Other changes are going to include a bunch of multiplayer fixes and stuff like that, along with the bows getting the reduction in hunting pressure. There's honestly so much good stuff jam-packed into this patch that I think you guys are really going to enjoy it once it releases, because it really is a phenomenal update. Probably one of the smoothest updates that I've seen in this game in recent months. Now, even though I don't play on console myself, I'm actually really excited for the release of Ti Awaroa on console because I know a lot of you that watch the channel have been eagerly awaiting this patch and have just been waiting for some kind of news to let you guys know when it's going to be released. And now you guys finally know, February 9th, there will be the release of Ti Awaroa on console and it's going to be an awesome day. Everybody can finally play this map that they've been waiting for. Let's uh, take out this goat wherever he went. I actually don't know where he disappeared to. Well, I don't have the right gun on me anyway, so guess that uh, really doesn't matter too much there. Typically, as a lot of you know, I really only post one video a day, but today I figured this was probably something that deserved a second upload, so hopefully this information makes you guys happy. Let's go ahead and shoot this little fallow deer right here once he lifts his head up so we can actually get a decent shot on his chest. And that looked to be pretty decent. And yeah, there he goes. Nice. Alright, here is that little fallow deer. Now, though we do have a console release date along with a bunch of the fixes that are going to be coming with that, one thing that I'm still curious about is whether or not this patch will get bundled with the next update because that's what they've done in the past with the Silver Ridge Peaks release. They released True X Mule Deer alongside of it with a bunch of different fixes and stuff like that, so I'm curious if they're going to do that. I mean, either way, it's still nice that they are finally getting a release date for this patch for you guys. But I'm kind of hoping that they end up bundling it with the next update also. That would make it really nice that everybody has some fresh new content to look at. Because even for you guys that have been playing on console, you guys have already seen a lot of the changes uh, just from watching videos and stuff. So it'd be nice if they had some brand new stuff added in there too. Uh, we'll see how that goes. I'm hoping it'll happen, but who knows if it actually will. But yeah, that's a pretty decent fallow deer. 189 is uh, not bad at all. Now, I'm not really sure what I'm going to do when this releases. I probably am going to continue doing the Great One grind. Uh, we've been trying to get the Great One for, seems like, forever now. So, we're going to continue that grind. But I might start up some more Ti Awaroa grinding once this finally releases on console. And that is a giant fallow deer right there. That is a monster. Let's get that guy down. Alright, here is this massive fallow deer. What a beautiful looking buck. Let's grab him. 218 on the score. That's not bad at all. That's a solid fallow deer. Very solid fallow deer. Well, anyway guys, I just wanted to make this quick little video here to let you guys know the release date and kind of do a little bit of uh, fallow deer hunting here on T. Awaroa. I know that a lot of you have been eagerly awaiting this information as I've said earlier in the video so I wanted to get it out as soon as possible. Typically I don't do two uploads a day but today is going to be that one exception. Now I hope you guys enjoyed 
we are gonna go ahead and end it there I'm just really happy that there's finally a release date so that you guys can finally have your uh, minds eased on whether or not there's going to be an update in February or not and well now we know so if you guys are brand new to the channel, consider subscribing. I do post daily videos along with five live streams a week. Also, be sure to like the video. It's a massive help in getting these videos recommended to more people. But with that being said, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you all in the next video. Peace.